This is a non-official server. Just wanted to show you the base that we built up on a five times harvest. Uh, this is your entry. So as you come in, there was a door here. Somebody's been busy. It's only a rank one door. And there'd be pikemen in here hitting you. There's one guy there, look. So you smash this door down. Same situation, he's got free run coming in here, so is he. So you come up, there's one upstairs. So this guy is hidden in there somewhere. And you've got to hack this door down with explosives. Uh, there's the guy that I was looking for with a, a knockdown club. This is the mate boy there. And another club guy. Let's go through door number two. Come up to here. We found out that when you put the C4, the exploding urns here, that it blows this up first rather than the door. The door always goes first before these steps. So they can use, I think it works out to be three to get through this door. Maybe four, can't remember now. Anyway, you come up, this will blow up and you're stuck. You can't get through here easy. Let's say you do, because situation where you got to blow up this door and another door and then you come up here all these arches to deal with maybe you've taken them out from down there so another door and another door round three door more arches a fighter that knocks you down these can be quite annoying when you take them on on the pirate ship so we've got uh, another door here with this method which blows up the steps because the steps this is supporting. So very hard to get through there. Uh, right, all the way through here, maybe you come up. Um, this goes all the way around. It goes all the way around there to this level. Let's show you a few of the things. This is one of our teammates, Colinar. He's offline at the moment. Let's go up here, a few chests, tannery, dancer to get rid of your possession, your corruption, fire, another tannery. This guy here, a name character, maybe we should have killed him for something, I don't know. But uh, another dancer, you can see health regen 2 here and there, one of the beds. Blacksmith's bench, carpenter's bench, <laughs> grey rhino trophy, fire and a well. So let's take you upstairs. Another door. There's the greater wheel of pain. So that's what you use to tame these or break their will. Let's go up here. This is the yog which I think is more so human flesh. You can eat it, it doesn't go off. So it's actually quite good, it gives you a regen and gives you food and water. So we'll go up here, more kind of tough ways to get through this uh, fighter here. I don't know whether he's a, a pikeman or a, a hammer one. He's probably a hammer, hammer one to knock you down. Uh, this door, when you come up here and see for this one, then this will actually blow up. We've been playing against people that are able to jump around and we've strategically put the higher rank walls and everything here. This is all tier 3. So go through this door again and this is where you get the safe. The vault is absolutely gorgeous to look at. I mean they've done such a nice job of that one. And here these are the explosive jars demon blood, some spare stuff, a bed, uh, lots of armor etc. So steel trident, steel heater shield. So this this is our kind of when everything goes pear-shaped down there. We spawn here, take the stuff out there, rush down. So it's really easy to do. I haven't found the archery to be that powerful. Melee is much more powerful. So I've left a lot of this open so we can see what's going on. Maybe here, shoot down on people. That's always good. Anyway, up here. This was left a colonar. He's Italian, so we put a bit of Italian flair and styling to this. 
we always leave the rooms to him and as you can see there's all chairs here, a throne yeah, it's well done, it's well done so I'll sit in the chair so you can see alright let's have a look around here these are quite a nice touch you can hear them quite a way be some kind of graphics glitch there that wasn't there a minute ago uh, it's like the sand is up there but there's the pirate ship down there and this is Age of Kona. it's kind of early access so it's not finished yet I'm recording this in 1080p with ultra graphics so to see what it will do there we go I won't jump off because it's sheer death that gives you an idea of the base that we've built.